Today we will discuss the female reproductive system of human being. This is located in pelvic region and comprises of a pair of ovaries, external genitalia, accessory ducts that is fallopian tube, uterus, cervix and vagina, accessory glands that is vestibular gland and mammary glands. All these collectively support the process of ovulation, fertilization, pregnancy, childbirth and lactation. Now a pair of ovaries. These are two in number, three centimeter long, two centimeter wide and one centimeter thick almond shaped female gonads. The ovary remains attached to the abdominal wall by a ligament called mesovarium. Each ovary is compact or solid organ consisting of an outer cortex and inner medulla. Okay. The stroma of the cortical region is composed of spindle-shaped fibroblasts and the cortex is covered by tunica elvuginia, which is dense connective tissue layer. Actually, it imparts the whitish color to the ovary. And surface of ovary is covered by germinal epithelium, which is formed of simple squamous or cuboidal cells, cuboidal epithelial cells. Accessory ducts. Number one, fallopian tube, also called oviduct. A pair of long tube that is 10 to 12 centimeter ciliated muscular and tubular structure help in conduction of zygote or ovum to uterus. These are also called as Mullerian duct M U W L E R I A N. Consist of infundibulum, funnel shaped part closer to ovary and possesses fimbriae which help in ova collection after ovulation. Ampulla, wider part of oviduct, opens into the third region that is isthmus, narrow part of duct. It links uterus and acts as fertilization site that is ampullary isthmic junction. Now uterus, also called boom. It is a single hollow muscular inverted pear shaped organ located in the pelvic region between bladder and rectum and suspended by ligament called meso mesometrium. It serves as site of fetal growth during pregnancy. The wall of uterus is composed of three layers of tissue that is perimetrium, myometrium, endometrium. Now female external genitalia that is vagina. It is fibromuscular elastic tube about 7.5 cm long into which uterus open. Mons pubis, it is a cushion of fatty tissue covered by skin and pubic hair, Levia majora. These are fleshy folds of skin extending from mons pubis surrounding the vaginal office or orifice. It is homologous to scrotum. 
लेविया मेनोरा पेयर्ड फोल्ड ऑफ स्किन अंडर लेविया मेजोरा कंटेन सिवेसियस ग्लैंड क्लिटोरिस टाइनी फिंगर लाइक स्ट्रक्चर लाइंग एट द अपर जंक्शन ऑफ लेविया मेनोरा इट इज एन इरेक्टाइल ऑर्गन इट इज होमोलोगस टू पेनिस एंड हाइमेन द ओपनिंग ऑफ बेजाइना इज ऑफन कवर्ड पार्शियली बाय ए मेम्ब्रेन कॉल्ड हाइमेन इट इज नॉट द इंडिकेटर ऑफ सेक्शुअल एक्सपीरियंस इट मस्ट बी इन माइंड नाउ मेमरी ग्लैंड a functional mammary gland is characteristic of all female mammals the mammary glands are paired structure also called breast that contain glandular tissue and variable amount of fat the glandular tissue of each breast is divided into 15 to 20 mammary lobes containing cluster of cells called alveoli the cells of alveoli secrete milk which is stored in the cavities that is lumen of alveoli the alveoli open into mammary tube tubules so this is all about female reproductive system of human